Come on up. Got me. Wait for it. Wait for it, though. Wait for this guy to peek. Man, shit, this guy is a fucking goof. Man, how do you... Are oh, you lucky to subscribe? I'll flame the fuck out of it. This guy doing a montage on this pedophile stream, bro. Alleyways is where they're going to find us. The next game is what we're going to get into. The next play, it's going to be a dominating one. The next snipe, 360 minimum. The next victory... Celebration time. I can't believe it. I just can't believe it. This guy has a whole intro of him being a pedophile. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. This is ridiculous. He has a montage. You think this is TikTok? The pedophilia trailer right here. How to Catch a Predator Part Season Number 17. Come on now. Get to the fucking case. I can't type. <laughs> Only channel subscribers of 13. I can't type. Fuck. As well. Come on. I'm not even gonna look at it. Bro got a whole montage, man. He got a whole mo oh. Oh. Pedophilia, damn, this brother can aim. Holy shit, what the fuck? I really do like this one. Surprise! <laughs> huh, my boomer? Huh? Boom! What is he doing? Bro, this is sad. That's pathetic. I'm not gonna lie, this is dead ass pathetic. Like he's really hyping up his montage and shit after he's supposed to be the, the pedophile intro. This is crazy. What was he accused of being a pedophile? What, what? Show me the proof again. Show me the proof again. Didn't he cheat on his girl? His wife? What a pedophile? Maybe he ain't? I don't know. The evidence looks stacked up against him, no? Thousand dollar knife. Is it done? 91 minutes. Oh! Too loud, bro. Men truly are scum. What the fuck did I do? Why are you saying men? I'm a feminist, but not all men are bad. Shout out to all the beautiful ladies out there. You know what I'm saying? Men are trash. <laughs> oh, man. Eat the Homelander. My Smith, Smith alerts, Smith alerts, Smith alerts, Smith alerts. Mana One X just subscribe. What is he doing, bro? My Smith alerts, Smith alerts, quick. Easy, easy. Rough landing. The name. He flew to Epstein Island. Oh, baby, 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 baby. The name. It's Doctor, Doctor. Dis. Respect. Spat. And you're looking at the two time back to back 1993 1994 blockbuster video Dude, game top, champion, top, true international top, video top, gaming top, superstar, top. ladies and gentlemen. It's a goddamn snooze fest. Don't be shy. Oh, it's been a long time, champs. The La Vacacion with Mi Familia was increíble. But we're back from vacation and we're getting locked in doing what we do best that's put on a show and <laughs> look good doing it by the way brand new arena champs let me give you a little tour oh come on don't be shy let's take a look uh oh 
It's, it's, it's dungeon. You're taking us to the dungeon. I'm gonna animation is sick. So. Brand new state of the art transport system. Inspired by Arnold Schwarzenegger and Running Man, I. What did he say? He races to and a pedophile. A little tight. A little Nick got some competition. Nonetheless, champs. The entrance into the arena. Oh, take a look around. I put a lot of money, my own money, invested into this facility. It's taken months and months. Hold on, I gotta go. He dead ass 42 acting like this, bro. He having a midlife crisis, like, actually. It's dead ass a midlife crisis, like, seriously. There's something about the VIP lounge. Currently, potentially could be closed down. I used to watch, I used to watch them all the time, but. Well, we'll get it all activated. We'll open these doors just for you, Champions Club members, real soon. You just had to be a pedophile, you fucking bastard. Nonetheless, take a look. Look what's waiting for you. Bro, he just, like, he's Cocktail, just stalling, bro. Black Wait, is there ads on blazers, YouTube? Jars of Vaseline, bow ties. And is there ads on YouTube? It's literally just an advertisement, that's it. Oh shit! Oh, how many seats he has? Thing, man. Uh, what is corny, man? What was I talking about? Oh, where are we? I'm in the lobby. So when you walk in through the front entrance of the arena, this, this is the is first corny, place bro. you this step shit, into, that is corny. and it's pretty incredible, isn't it? This is where you can kick your feet up, grab some popcorn, multiple big screens inside the lobby, check in. Do what you need to do to get ready for the show. And did he mention? Me, literally, we're gonna put on a show. Excuse me. He—he's he, not even talking about situation. Just talking about his new season. That's it. Go diss with Dantes. Does he want a Discord? As a Champions Club member. This is one of the best spots inside of the arena. Oh, that's that has FC Island over here. I swear it is. Infinity this is weird, pool. bro. This is weird, bro. <laughs> Put on your speedos. Do a coffin. Uh, this is all that humor. Oh boy, oh boy, you can impress your friends with the biggest splash imaginable. Basically, all you got to do is jump off the diving board, lean back, cover. Your Wait, what if this some psychological thing where you just like make people just forget about the thing? By showing other good things so the people for not get too angry about the actual problem. Isn't that like a psychological thing? Okay, hold on. This is the actual thing. Hold on. All right. Heated pool. It is heated. Turn the music up, pedophile. Heated. Why am I so orange? I mean, I... I didn't get a, I didn't get a fake tan. This thing's real, okay? This thing's real. A bit funny, Just dipping you. our toes in the water, chance. Huh? Let's wake up! Why are you trying to hype up the crowd? Most of the people here are trying to see why he's we a better. Gotta wake up. We trying to see why you a pedophile. What has been happening? Ha what has been happening in the video gaming scene, champs? Oh my Anybody god! Anybody tell me, Doc? What games we playing today? I got Black Ops Six beta lined up. Nobody I don't said know that. About it. Nobody said that. He's off track. Nobody said what games you're playing. Doctor Diddler. That's I don't know anything about. I just why you're a pedophile. We don't care about your game, bro. Get to the point. Why do you touch kids, bro? You fucking weirdo. 
I get any tight. Doc. Us. Fun Wordle. God, man. Get oh, down, boy. Why would, even... Why would I entertain the idea of playing minimizing jacks? He's not even reading the chat, bro. Did you do it or not? Oh my God, he's doing Wordle. Oh my God, he needs to kill himself. No, no, he needs to kill himself. I swear he needs to kill himself. This is pre-recorded to the maximum. He's doing a cookie low. I swear he's doing a cookie low. Elephant in the room, Doc. We're waiting. Oh my God. Oh God. It's the worst of the worst of the worst of the worst of the thing I've ever 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 ever. Just relax, man. <laughs> waiting on it. Come on out there, you did it. Huh? There's a special breed of people out there, aren't you? Holy shit. Bro, this guy's a sociopath, like, actually. How's it on YouTube? I don't fucking know. Let me play my damn Wordle. You might want to grant that. Okay. Okay. I will. Mr. Crump with a $10 donation. Give it back, my duck! I'm going to get to the donations in a bit. I, I, I... Oh, my God. He's thinking. How do you don't know? How do you don't know? How do you don't know? Hold up. Do I, will he actually read it? I, 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 Does he actually read it? Stop, guys. Too many... Too... No, no, no. Let me play Wordle first. Okay. Should we be in? What's his donor cap? Hundred dollar? Is he gonna fuck? Does it pop up? It's gotta be it, right? Does it pop up, bro? Get to the fucking point. Scott. I'm jumping right in, man. Nah, nah, I nah, played, nah, nah. I haven't played a video game. I'm not, I'm not. I'm not stupid. Don't worry, I'm not. In a long, long time. It's been a couple months. You know. He talking about games. It's been a bro. couple months. He talking about games. He is stalling, bro. Why is he stalling this shit? Just absolutely. Wait, do you get paid for ads on YouTube or no? Social media and from the industry. And I'm telling you, you talk about just an uplifting, feel good scenario. Welcome back to Time You Look Rested, says Knuckles with a $5 donation. Oh man, are we rested? We did some, uh, man, a lot of camping, hiking. Bro, bro, you know what's crazy? Look at his chat. Swimming. Bro, look at his chat. Look at his chat. Just, just read his chat. People are actually like some, of the, like half of the people are actually with him. Like I said, vacation was good. Well needed. Uh, there's no way I'm gonna keep up with these donations. <sighs> I, I especially. Why are you calling him Doc Petto? Because he is. What? Allegedly. I just want to see what he has to say to it. They don't have Twitter. E e e. I'm saying allegedly, so I don't get sued. You're always supposed to say allegedly. Always. Get. Strat, strat, strat. Oh, he corny, like bro, bro, like he is so corny, man. I can't watch this, like he's done as corny. He is so unfunny. No, no, like he's actually having a midlife crisis. Walla. Erode. It's gonna give me some info. No, but you know what? You know what's the crazy part? His fan base is legit above thirty years old. Like he usually has like older people in his chat. He's cooked. Resty, resty, resty. Okay. Now right, you get the three. All right, you. How many points? I forgot. You can't make the shit up, bro. Well, like he's playing Wordle. You can't make the shit up, bro. You eyes can't make the shit up. Rat, 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 ren, 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 ren. Rep, 
Repi. You mind if the cracker is sending out to the corner ref, store? Ref, 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 referral, refer, 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 huh? Oh, but we got our two R's though, man. I knew. But, but we got to boil it, man. Look, he. Reary, rear, 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 rear. Re, 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 retro, retro. There you are. No, it's not. R ready. We gonna kill him, bro. He's already gone. In game. Hmm. Yo, Q type him Call of Duty. We gotta, we gotta boil him. He said he's gonna play Black Ops Six. Somebody needs to Q type him. Just like you know, use the open mic shit. We gotta do that. Bro, you, are you serious? There's no way he's serious. Re this, has to be, this has to be pre-recorded. This has to be pre-recorded, pre 100%. I know he has 13 weeks subscriber Almost mode. get it within the first three. Right, champs? You get your points. Not a big deal. He baited you all into watching him? Yeah, but this viewers is not going to stay. Most of the people are here as to why, he, wins a lot as of to why he did it. Just remember that. That's how that game Why played. is he a diddy? What happened? What's his side of it? That's how that game's played. I, he he been admitted to this shit, but like, what's the re like? What? No way he's gonna play another game. I saw he plays another game. He's shaking. Yeah, just keep ignoring the issue and putting up this act. God, I'm so concerned and worried about everyone else's problems except mine because I'm dealing with a deeper depression and I like to project. <laughs> oh, Yo, he's, champs, champs, champs. See, bro, he's a he's a cornball. A lot ball. of people donating. I I do appreciate it. I do appreciate it. He's a cornball. You know? Bro, what happened? What the fuck happened to D D spec? Hey, I that as easy. Are you nervous to be back? After what's transpired over the last couple months, am I excited to be back to this? I can hear it though, right? I can hear it. Type of world. <laughs> yeah, I. Man. That's it, oh boy. Oh, holy fuck, man. I'm curious how much money he's making off this shit now. So glad you're back. Hey, I appreciate it, si Shane. Nobody said that. Nobody. <laughs> nobody said right, that, bro. We got to figure out this monetization thing. So it's September 25th. Oh, my God. He's shameless. Is, is basically when we can reapply for partnership on YouTube. Oh, you my know? God. People ask, like, do, do I... Now that you're not getting monetized, you're not going to be streaming ever again or you're on YouTube, are you? I, I'm. There's an opportunity to reapply, right? There's September no way they're going to let him. This is the date. They're never going to allow it. So they're never going to allow that. They're never going to allow that. I doubt we'll, it. I, I, bro, if they we'll do what we need to do, if they allow him uh, to get a partner, but I guarantee YouTube's going to get mad, time, mad hate for that shit. Or he's going to go to kick. You know, we've built a I think nice, he's probably gonna go to kick community for years. This is where we started. Nah, sixteen years ago. How much money? I doubt it. They're gonna lose more money by having him on a partner. Two thousand and eight, I think. YouTube would literally lose more money. You know, by having him on partner, people would start like boycotting there or some shit. And I like the community. It's we've got the best, realist gaming community, right? The Champions Club. Nah, nah, bro. Kick the got mad pedophiles over there, we've bro. We built it on this platform. They just like this him. Is and if there's an opportunity to reapply for partnership, and there's a date that's been presented to us, then I'm going to take it. In the meantime, like we always done, we've always stayed in our lane. We'll stay in our lane and continue to just put on a show. So he's you basically know? catering to his, his, his basic fan base. The ones that, 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 that support for pedophilia. four years. He's basically catering yeah. to, to his fan base. And basically, accept me who I am. The doc regarding the Twitch suspension. 
I guess since you all missed the point with my personal statement. Got 180k views. Maybe it's time to tell my side of the story. Huh, champs? We're waiting. It's been. You uh... see, there was a lawsuit pending. And as part of that arbitration, all parties were not allowed to speak publicly about the case. <laughs> I respected those rules. My lawsuit against Twitch was eventually resolved, as you all know. But even then, as part of the settlement, all parties were still prohibited from speaking publicly about the case or the settlement. However, if one side violated that confidentiality, then the other side could respond. And again, I saw shut chance, the fuck up, man. Again, I respected all the confidential obligations. <laughs> mm -mm. But apparently Twitch's own disgruntled employees didn't feel the need to well, abide I'm, I'm by those again. same You're cancer, man. obligations. You're cancer. Cody Connors, ex-Twitch employee, wasn't even involved, leaks Twitch's reported reason. Years later, Cody, why, why, you, why do this? Who's Cody? What was the point? Who's Cody? Is that the Twitch guy? This was settled professionally. And you, knowing how black and white the internet is, you decided, you fucking rat, to leak the reported reason Twitch banned me uh. in 2020. Well, I mean, for what, Cody? Why? Did you not know the repercussions from spewing lies about the two time? Did you not know the repercussions? How? Of he literally admitted me? to it. He literally Cody admitted Connors? to it. You see, you don't know shit. Hey, it was obvious from your tweet. You didn't have any firsthand knowledge of my dispute with Twitch. You said that I got banned from Twitch because I was sexting a minor through whispers messages. Did he not say that? <laughs> Do you even know what the legal definition of sexting is? I do. And yeah, I used Twitch's whispers, but trust me, I wasn't sexting anyone. You also said the word minor, Cody. I even made sure that word was emphasized in my statement, edited, etc., just to make sure these so-called journalists would pick up on it. <laughs> and boy, oh boy, did they ever, champs. When you and all these so-called journalists, Cody, fired off your tweets, did any of you consider that the Twitch user may have been over the legal age of consent at the time of the messages? You didn't. Neither did any of these journalists and neither did Twitch at the time of the ban. You also tried to tell the world that I was trying to meet up with this user at TwitchCon, but you're wrong. Let's set the record straight. I never intended to meet this user ever. We never made plans to meet at TwitchCon or anywhere else. And in <laughs> fact, boss, boss, we never boss. met <laughs> in person ever. <laughs> your bullshit accusations gave false courage to other former Twitch employees to make shit up as well. <laughs> I suspect all of you sort of planned and coordinated <laughs> this attack. These big time publications, these, these journalists, these various outlets, are sort of just gossip, gossip channels now, don't you Somebody think, Chips? Tweet? Somebody give me his tweet. They act like they're just gossip channels now. Did his tweet not Without say any real journalism and real Did research it? happening. Someone give me his tweet. Someone give me his tweet. They report on all this based on leaks from two former Twitch employees, one of whom was supposedly on the trust and safety team. He deleted it? If these anonymous sources worked on the trust and safety team at the time of my Twitch suspension in 2020 then you would hope they would tell the truth. But apparently that's just too much to ask. If these former trust and safety team members, and by the way, I know exactly who they are, <laughs> actually had firsthand knowledge, then what they conveniently left out is, one, Twitch's trust and safety team, the same employees that decided to ban me, internally admitted that the whisper messages were not sexting. And two, Twitch's trust and safety team, the same employees that decided to ban me, internally acknowledged that the whispers did not constitute child sexual abuse material CSAM. I'll say it again. Neither I nor the Twitch user exchanged any sexual graphic messages or images. 
Cody Connors and these other anonymous sources are trying to paint a picture that I was exchanging sexually explicit messages and photos with this Twitch user. That never happened. I even used the word inappropriate purposely. And look at how it was defined by everyone, champs. Huh? Including these defaming articles. I'm sorry, but mutual bantering with inappropriate jokes taken out of context should have never led to me getting banned from Twitch in the first place. I mean, are the messages out there? How would each of, of you said? Are the messages look out there? If all of your private DMs, your text messages, your chats no. were looked at, dissected, and taken out of context by someone who's deliberately trying to find something inappropriate in those words. And this is not a situation where a victim publicly accuses someone of wrongdoing. That never happened here. We're talking about allegations that Twitch made against me as a half-baked reason for justifying their actions of suspending and shutting down my channel. Allegations that Twitch made without even a legal analysis of whether the whisper messages were legal! You see, I engage with my community. I engage with other streamers. And through Twitch whispers, I communicate with Twitch users. Conversations that consisted of a variety of playing games and gaming politics, content creation, random stuff. This was the extent of my whispers with this Twitch user. On June 21st, 2020, my ex Twitch partner manager learns that I exchanged whispers with the Twitch user. <laughs> and I say ex partner manager because for years, this guy didn't do anything for me, my community, or my channel. For years. I'm talking no front page love. You're talking about the face of the platform, right? Literally, the face of the platform. We heart. And I know Champions Club remembers this. We got, we got zero front page love on the website. Uh, he was never on my channel. He didn't follow me on Twitter. He said he, gri oh, he, he we wouldn't even inform us about Twitch rival tournaments. We're talking about the two time. Twitch rival tournament. Oh, I'm sorry. I got, I, would you, would you want to play in it? <laughs> we got zero support from this guy. And it was just so obvious that he carried a grudge against the two time. So after we signed with Twitch in 2019, we asked for a new partner manager. And just a few months later, that ex Twitch partner manager is directly involved with getting me banned. <laughs> Coincidence? The Twitch user tells the ex-Twitch partner manager that they do not want to report anything to Twitch. I'll repeat that sentence one more time just in case anybody missed that one. The Twitch user tells oh, this ex-Twitch uh, partner part, manager yeah, that they do not want to report anything to Twitch. Uh, uh, he needs but to talk about the evidence. Twitch partner manager encourages the user and even directs them to file a report directly with Twitch even though the user told him clearly that we never physically met anywhere and that no photographs were exchanged. On June 24th, 2020, Twitch's special operations team receives and reviews the user's report. They find no issues and determine that it did not warrant any further escalation to Twitch's law enforcement response team. <clears throat> that would have been the end. <laughs> that should have been the end. But that partner manager, oh boy, oh boy, did he had it out. Yeah, he had it out for the two time. He finds out that no further action will be taken. So what does he do? He personally escalates the report to a friend on the Twitch's LER team. The LER team, remember, that's the Twitch's law enforcement response team. He escalates the report to a friend on Twitch's LER team. So a day later, on June 25th, the LER analyst pulls the entirety of the whisper messages and begins discussing them with his director of the LER team. Mind you, this director is on vacation at that time and does not have access to their computer or work files. L let me just remind you, I went through a multi-year, multi a, a big time arbitration, okay? And uh, you know, you discover a lot of stuff. 
Mind you, this director is on vacation at that time. The LER analyst cherry picks and sends a few targeted excerpts out of context from the whisper messages to this director. Now, if you do this, you can make anyone's messages look inappropriate, even when they aren't. Within less than one hour, this LER analyst and his director have made the decision to suspend me from Twitch. Twitch submits a report to NCMEC. You guys all read those. What the fuck? MCM? The NCMEC. Twitch submits that report. Who's that? Who's that? The National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. Guess what? As far as I know, and over four years have passed, they didn't do anything with the report. As far as I know, they didn't escalate Twitch's report to law enforcement. <laughs> Mind you, the same people that made this decision admit internally yeah, that it's... the messages did not constitute sexting. It's... The same people that made this decision at Twitch admit internally that the messages did not warrant any child sexual abuse material charge. Twitch makes this decision to terminate my contract and ban me while admitted they did not perform any legal analysis of whether the messages exchanged were illegal in any way. Twitch makes this decision to terminate my contract and ban me while admitting that they never investigated the age of consent in the jurisdiction where the user's messages were sent and received. Twitch say, makes this decision to terminate well, my contract and ban me without one one. ever interviewing me, the user, or any other third party, including the partner manager. It's fucking unbelievable! Shit, sorry, my fault. That's a pedal rage right there. Shit, give me that bucko. Oh fuck! Watch out, kids. Watch out. I'm not gonna get into every detail regarding my legal case, <clears throat> but these former Twitch employees that claim to have firsthand knowledge, they just don't have a clue. They didn't report any facts. The judge in the case determined that the whispers were not illegal. <laughs> so then why did Twitch use these messages against me? I, I, why did Twi Twitch treat the doc so differently from their other streamers? I mean, outside of the obvious. I mean, but did you message me. them or not? Explain the message, Unfiltered. bro. Like, it's he saying, he said, she said, he said, she said, bro. Uh-oh, I don't know. Six foot eight, gorgeous, athletic, successful, ah, college man. degree, yeah, college ball, athlete, bro. bourbon he business, gaming 40, studio, bro. beautiful family. And trust me, we've worked hard for over a decade to improve as a person, a husband, and father, and to get where we're at today. I mean, I'm in such a good place today. And all these people, they all act like they're just so perfect. I'm not perfect. I don't claim to be perfect. Eh, sometimes I do. But I also didn't do all the shit that they're saying I did. But then that doesn't make a story, right? They wanted media attention. The media wants controversy. And by sensationalizing all this with big and accurate headlines like sexting and sexually explicit, you all got what you wanted at the expense of the tube time. The reality is they wanted to cut down the dock, plain and simple. Take a look at some of these horrendous acts of Twitch streamers that were never banned. I've got some examples right here. Example number one, a streamer that frequently used the N word while publicly streaming, which constitutes a violation of Twitch's policies no! if accompanied by I'm hateful sorry. intent. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Twitch scheduled a meeting no! with the streamer to assert no! his intent to determine I'm, whether I'm his sorry. contact was a violation I'm of sorry. Twitch's policies. He is not a Ultimately problem. determining it was not a breach of Twitch's policies. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Why he wasn't I called I'm into, sorry. A, sorry. into a meeting? Sorry. Why wasn't my intent taken into consideration, Chad? <laughs> He's innocent. Hmm. Example number two. Streamer was reported for discussing doing things with deceased animals and discussing pedophilia all while live streaming. Never suspended, but instead given a multi-million dollar contract. Example about? number three. 
Who's the streamer was reported for a sexually explicit stream involving children and telling children to send Snapchats of them playing with themselves. Hey, Never suspended, yo. but instead, hmm, is given a multi-million dollar contract. Wait, who are they talking about? Who are they talking about? There's more pedophiles. It's so obvious that certain Twitch executives, employees involved had oh, personal biases shit. against the doc. Oh, shit. And used all of this as an opportunity oh, to terminate my contract. Oh, shit. Go oh. back and look at the timing of all this, too. Huh. Nick is cooked, bro. He is cooked. The doc's termination lines up with two for preferable, Nick. profitable, and that. expensive Get streamers that. leaving Mixer. Docophile. That's what I'm calling him. Docophile. As soon as Twitch knew that Mixer had failed, and go look at the timing. These other expensive streamers needed a new streaming platform. So Twitch rushed through its decision to terminate the two time. You see, I shouldn't even be banned from Twitch. It has affected us on so many levels. Back in 2020 and now in 2024. <laughs> you get three examples. Nick, how's this said? <laughs> And Cody, Connors, I just have to say it again. <laughs> Why would you do this? Like I said, this was handled professionally years ago. No fucking wrongdoing. But because of you, Cody, we just lost. Ah, fuck, man. Is he going to show the messages? Wait, what Unfortunately, we have to lay off people from Midnight Society. What did this guy just type? Right. I honestly because feel you, bad for the doc. Oh, you're getting permud. Oh, you're getting permud. No, 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 no. The, the, the people are like uh, defending uh, defending this shit. They ain't a permud. Permud. <clears throat> what? You know, through all this, we are where we are. Destiny I'm like viewers? a fucking man, I'll accept it. But I don't accept to sit in quietly by and let these idiots attack me with false accusations, no. For all these doc haters out there too, oh man. The ones that project and project and project and project and worry about everyone else's problems, right? I, I can't understand that mindset. I don't give, I could care less. We've always stayed in our lane. But somehow, some way, these people, they just get in our lane. For all you doc haters, I'm sure you'll dissect, dissect all of this and still find a way to publicly criticize me. Do what you need to do. I'll say this. This isn't for you. This was for my team today, my community, my friends, la familia that have supported me. I said, over here. And I'm not denying the exchange of whispers, champs. I'm not denying that to, to all of you out there. It looks bad. I have no way of knowing if the Twitch users thought our exchange of whispers was inappropriate. If it was, I apologize. All I, all I know is that I never did what Twitch, Cody Connors, or the public is claiming that so I he's did. he's basically blaming the people that exposed him. He's basically mad at the people that exposed him, basically. He's mad that he got caught. Simple as that. That's so it. He just... Oh, my God. This guy is sick. I'm not saying anything more about any of this. Right? He's mad that they just Unless I need him. to, because trust me, I have more. I haven't disclosed. I just want to get back to what we do best. Put on a show and climb our way to the tippity top of the mountain, man. In our own lane. That's it. He just turned on oh, he just turned on gay bar music now. Guys, I'm not a pedophile. <laughs> the gaslighter, okay? So he's mad at first that it was getting handled with the court case, right?
They banned him for no reason what he said at first. And then when they found out that's what they banned him and they were handling it legally, Twitch got their lawyer side and tried to review him and didn't find anything like illegal is what he said. And then they brought it to the court and the court said it wasn't illegal or some shit. And then he said now it wasn't inappropriate. And then uh, Hancock just gave me a TLDR. Okay, let's see. What did he say? The Twitch staff that leaked over-exaggerated it, but it doesn't dissolve him from the fact he messaged a minor inappropriately when he was 38 years old with a wife and a kid. It was around the time he cried on stream about cheating on his wife, so the timeline adds up. But he said it wasn't inappropriately. Did he, did he not say it wasn't inappropriately? He said it wasn't inappropriately, but where's the logs? But like, where is the logs to this? All of this? Is it out there or is these only logs? Did he not say grip? He's gripping his shit. That is inappropriately. That that's literally just sexing, is it not? He gripping his shit, bro. He talking about he gripping his dick, like he said it wasn't sexy, but maybe it was inappropriately. He said he he. he, he he said she was legally not a minor. That's a sex, sex worker. So how old is this one? That wasn't the minor. So what did he say to the minor? No one knows. So why is he not? Why is he not showing it to prove he's innocent? I don't understand that. Because he's a retard, because he's banned, because he's not innocent, because he's lying, because he's locked by law. He should definitely have it if he's if it's a lawsuit, is it not? Why would he show up if no one has proof to prove his innocence? I think it's safe to say that I speak on behalf of every single person on this platform when I say that we forgive you, chin up, shoulders back, you know the blue haired, I mind all these berries will change. <laughs> that is funny. He just likes to troll, bro. Just yet. But we're, we'll figure it out. He's we'll figure it out. He's retarded, man. I, I think I might be smarter than Dr. Disrespect. If I was innocent, I'd just show the logs. You know what I'm saying? But is it not? Aren't you not? Aren't you just even more guilty by just not showing it? Like, if you're really innocent, then show it. Right? He isn't allowed to the NDA, but didn't the NDA get breached to the point where you're allowed to show it? Isn't, isn't it, or didn't he say he's allowed to? The NDA was violated, yeah. He literally said the NDA was violated. Not as the logs of him chatting to the minor, but the fact that he isn't showing them is rather odd. If he wants to clear his name of the wrongdoing, especially when he claims he baited the media with his tweet, he is just trying to paint himself as a victim. Is what Hancock said. I don't know. Only he knows how long this whisper will last. Nah, he's, he, he, should, he should show the logs if he's so innocent. And then when somebody said that in the chat, he said, what are we, in middle school? I, I'm, I'm, I, may, I may be retarded, but is that not just showing you're guilty? Like, if someone's making a claim to legit hurt my career, right? I don't know. What do y'all think? Is he a pedo still? Yes, no. Is he a bear? I'm gonna say a bear. I'll let the chat vote. Who's voting no? Oh my God. Who's vote? Oh, 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 no. 
No, I swear, if I can see your names, if I can see your names, who's voting no? We got to catch them. Allahi, we got to catch them. Sanchez on his... No, no, this has to be a troll. This has to be a troll. This has... 20%? No, 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 no. This is legit a troll. You got pedos in your chat? No, no, no. They're legit trolling now. They're unironically trolling. They're unironically trolling. We can't see names? I don't, no, we can't see names. Hashinshin. No, is this not like Hashinshin's case? Is it not like Hashinshin's case? But with Hashinshin's case, we saw his logs of him legit saying weird shit to the girl. The FBI cleared him. That's what he said as well. He said the court cleared him as well. Why doesn't the girl leak it? I don't know. He said the girl didn't want it to out. Because settlement's out of courts. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure once the NDA gets breached, you're allowed to. Do we have any lawyers in here, like actual lawyers? Like, I'm that ass retarded. I don't know the law. Is someone, is anyone here a lawyer? I'm sure we have at least like one lawyer here. Are you allowed to leak? Are you allowed to say whatever about the case once the NDA was breached? Mojo's a lawyer. Mojo! She got paid, Dumbo. She ain't leaking shit. In his case, yes, he literally said so. That's what he said, yeah. NDA breached or not, you can still get sued by Doc. He can sue me? He can sue me? Hey, this is all a joke. I am poor. No, no, please. i sorry. I, the doctor disrespect. He did nothing. Uh, allegedly, everything I said in this VOD was all a joke. This is all a joke. I did nothing wrong. I am just broadcasting this live video. I am retarded. Do, 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 do. I just play League of Legends. Throw, 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 throw axes. Do, do, do. Throw, throw axes. Q, Q, adds three minutes. Yeah. Allegedly, he said. Allegedly. Loss of defamation. I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. But this is why the law is scary. Because you can legit get fucked over. He has a lot of money. Like, I'm not even trolling you. Like, I think if he wanted to catch my ass, he would catch my ass. I swear to God. He would legit, he would legit fuck me over. I gotta leak my VOD. I gotta, I gotta leak my VOD. I'm, not, I'm standing on 10 toes down. 10 toes down. Everything is just a joke. This is all a joke. Just saying. This is all for comedic purposes. What he did and said is wrong is all what he said. Everything I said is non-facts. Just saying that everything I said is allegedly. Call him a pedo again? No, I'm not. Anybody tell me? Did anybody tell me? I still can't believe he's acting like this, though. Like, he's dead-ass retarded. Like, 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 you, you, okay, like, you guys call me a retard. Like, y'all call me a retard, but I, I, I can't ever be like this. You know what I'm saying? It's his character. Yeah, but in a serious moment like this, wouldn't you think in your right mind to not be in your character? Raul! Gillette! Nah, bro, why you gotta be a pedophile, bro? Why, man? Why, bro? Raul! Gillette! Nah, that song was goaded. Would you act like this too if, you, if it made you millions? Back your video drivers. 100%, but there comes a certain time where you break out of character. Do you not? Like what? Like imagine he's at a funeral and he's dressed up like this shit, bro. Like, serious moments, you shouldn't just do that. He legit got a $1,000 donation? Did he actually? Oh, my God. How do pedophiles get a $1,000? Can I get a $1,000 donation, please? Please, can I get a $1,000 donation? Like, 
Where are the love for the non-pedophiles, bro? Like, I'm dead ass innocent. I'm just racist. That's it. Can I get a thousand dollars? Like, he's dead as a pedophile. Like, when his was exposed for being a pedophile, like, people were getting him subs. Cookie Low was uh, exposed for being a, uh, literally a child for a child rapist. He got get to, like, a hundred subs to stream. I didn't get shit this stream. Can I get some subs? Can I get some donos? Shit, bro. Like, how are these pedophiles winning? What the fuck, man? Show some love to a brother who's innocent, bro. Put that pussy on stream. I'll give you a bang right now. Ah, chill. Yo, chat. did you know you can actually turn a dick to a pussy? I did not know that till like last week. That shit was crazy. I didn't know that. I did not know that. <laughs> I, I didn't know that. What the, no, I'm, I'm dead ass. Somebody said you could legit get surgery, cut your, your dick, and they legit make your balls into like sort of like a pussy. That's what I heard. That's what I heard. You know what I'm saying? I didn't know that. He's crying? <laughs> I can't read that. Way. No, 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 you should. I'll, I'll straight. Day one, and I'm already losing my mind. Oh, he's gonna be in card lobbies. People are gonna snipe him and just call him a pedophile. Ooh, it's gonna be goaded. The clip's about to be goaded. They about to diddy his ass. Loaded player oh, stats. We should that Q snipe him on BO6. Nah, 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 nah. hundred dollars! Quit the desktop. Chance, I gotta tell you, I'm, I'm excited about something coming up. He got a hundred, bro. I, 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 I'm excited about something that's coming up. Right? I will. Don't worry, please. I'm going Chat. to be climbing to fifteen thousand feet. You don't give a fuck. He don't give a fuck. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. You know the method now. Lock in. What's your biggest dono? Uh, Karibo. Karibo, when I first started streaming, kickstarted my stream. He gave me $15,000. Don't know. Karibo is the GOAT. $15,000. He gave me $15,000. He gave Bacon $15,000. He gave, uh, he gave multiple streamers $15,000 to go to Korea. Yeah. I, bro. If he says Hamza, I need to go down on me. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, he kickstarted my shit, though. Where he at, though? I need some, too. He, he, he's no longer here, bro. I found him from Korea Trip. Korea Trip is what kickstarted my career because of him. He legit kickstarted my career. He died? No, I, he's still here, present, but here and there. You know what I'm saying? It was, he gave me, uh, yeah, he gave me the most, I believe. I booed Fahad, Wade Paz. I mean, Fahad, which is Wade Paz, Mike, Ahmed. Like, all my top gifters, like, they all gave me mad donos, bro. They all showed me mad love. Elo Daddy can go suck my dick. He owes me 1.5k. He hasn't gave me 1.5k. You got the Oilers of Doom? Nah, dead ass. We really do, bro. Like, if we compare my gifters and Oilers to, like, any other stream, bro, Man, they y'all love me, bro. I love y'all too. Give me a kiss. I won't let y'all down, bro. Like I promise you, I won't let y'all down, bro. Like y'all here as an investment. Y'all won't ever have to worry about me being a a pedophile or anything wrong. Only thing I I I, I may have said or remotely have said is might be racist. That's it. But this is the past, Hamza. I am now a good boy. You know what I'm saying? But that's about it. You know what I'm saying? I'm clipping this for the future allegations. Go ahead, clip it. Clip it. <laughs> clip it, bro. <laughs> clip it. I'm, you know what I'm saying? But, like, I, I'm, I'm getting older to the point where it's like... I'm getting older to the point where it's like... I am getting really mature. I don't say stupid shit no more. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I don't say stupid shit no more. What about terrorism? 
I am not streaming on 9-11, bro. I'm, I'm not going to hear the end of it on, on that day. I am watching your stream with my family. Why did you just try to kiss my 70-year-old niece? Man, shut the fuck up, retard. <laughs> 